steps to walk every day is a question that I get lots of time. How many should be the target steps so that you can lose weight, be fit forever and maintain an optimum fitness level? This is a question I know you all have right now watching this video. You will get the answer but you have to watch this video till the end to understand why we need to walk, how many steps should be there. You'll get that magic number that you need to walk every day but wait. You have to watch this video till the end to understand how we achieve that number, why we are walking those particular steps and what should be in our mind while walking. So you'll get all your answers but before that you know you have to subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you never miss any update from my channel. We're just going for the workout right but before that I hope that you all know that diet plays a very important role when it comes to your health and fitness journey and being on a diet doesn't mean you have to restrict yourself but it has to be mindful it has to be clean when I talk about my diet my fitness body is these body wise no sugar apple cider vinegar gummies that I have been having since last two to three months every day they're really tasty they have no added sugar and they have been my partner for fitness for sure they help me get rid of all the unwanted cravings boost my metabolism and especially they don't have any added sugar, no gluten and 100% vegan. It has also improved my digestion a lot. So yes, definitely one gummy a day makes my day full and, and helps me get rid of those unwanted cravings. These apple cider vinegar gummies are packed with vitamins and minerals and as apple cider vinegar is really beneficial for your body in order to curb the unwanted cravings, definitely give this a try. Link would be there in my description. Being a nutritionist myself, I can recommend these apple cider gummies to you because they don't have any added sugar and it will help you get rid of the unwanted cravings that you have during the day. So yes, you can definitely give it a try. So now let's start from the beginning. Not the beginning when I was born, but when my ancestors were born. How they were used to think about their fitness. Don't you think that they never went to any gym, no equipments, then how they were so fit and active that they were able to gather food, they were able to hunt, they were able to manage all the things around? It is because they were walking every day. You know that our ancestors that were you, uh, the hunters and gatherers used to walk about 15,000 steps every every day on an average. This is because they, their job was such a demanding job like a farmer or a waiter. For your reference, here's a list of jobs and the number of steps an average num person who per does that particular job actually walks for a day. Most of us have been into a sedentary lifestyle because of our routine sitting jobs. We all are in front of television, our computer screens, our mobile phones and we don't often that walk that much. And that's why the cardiovascular diseases that used to happen previously were much lesser as compared to the cardiovascular diseases that happen to people nowadays. The number has been drastically up and that you have to understand the reason being that we are not walking enough and because we are not walking enough our active to passive ratio is really less. So how many should be an average steps for a day? It varies from location to location as well. From countries to countries every person who live in a particular country has a different number. You know in Hong Kong there are about 7000 steps a person walks in a day. When it comes to India, it turns out to be 4,500 around. Check this reference so you know how location matters when it comes to number of steps walked per day. Definitely, when it comes to more personal level, we have to be mindful of walking more and more. We have to be mindful of including more steps in our day by including some activities that makes you walk more by tracking it. Now, how to track the number of steps that you have walked for a day? There's a huge market out there for the fitness watches, fitness bands, and we heavily depend on them to achieve our targets. And now I understand some people might be thinking that we don't have that much money to spend on a fitness band or a fitness watch. And that's completely fine. I don't have a fitness watch. Everybody around me have it. So how I manage my steps and how I make sure that I am walking is just because in ancient time, there were no fitness bands or fitness watches. They used to walk for a particular time. 
every day they knew that if they are going to walk for this particular time doing the all these activities they are going to achieve these target steps they were not mindful of achieving that target but they were doing it uh, b- without being mindful involuntarily but still they were achieve fitness levels and that's what i want you to achieve as well fitness these are good equipments surely they are really very helpful but if you are someone who are not uh, ready to invest on these kinds of equipments it's completely fine you just have to to go out start and walk for at least 1 hour if you walk for 1 hour you are able to achieve 10000 steps a target this is something you can do definitely so the timing is what's important rather than the number of steps so so the magic number when it comes to number of steps walking per day varies from person to person depends on what kind of activity level you want to achieve here is again a list of activity level that you want to achieve and the number of steps you want to achieve for example i want to be really active fit and want to uh, achieve a next level on into my fitness journey so i'll be walking 15000 steps a day for sure apart from all the fitness activities i i'm doing but if you are just beginning i would recommend going for 11000 steps a day or 12000 steps a day and that's completely fine you can actually make sure that you achieve this target slowly and steadily and do not push yourself too much do not rush into getting something that uh, will force on to you and feels like a punishment just make sure you slow and steadily develop a habit slow and steadily increase the number of steps and again if you don't have fitness band you're not able to track the steps focus on time start with 30 minutes walk then 40 minutes walk then 50 minutes walk then 60 and slowly and steadily you can actually increase it to 90 minutes so this is a pattern that you need to follow when it comes to walking that can give you great results and a fitness like our hunters and gatherers just just give it a thought and see you will get all your answers in our history itself so yeah that's it for this video i hope you will find it useful if you did don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon along if you never want to miss any update from my channel and yeah i'll see you soon in my next video bye bye stay fit stay happy